Today, the Salt Lake City Police Department is announcing the arrest of more than a dozen people last night at a homeless camp downtown. Three were booked and more were cited and released. But the question remains, how many of the people who were arrested were actually people experiencing homelessness and how many were activists? Now, we start off tonight with team coverage of these protests and arrests and we begin with Fox 13's Adam Herbetz. This was supposed to be just a normal night in Salt Lake City. We are home! You go home! Some campers say they don't know these people. Less cops, more shelters. My tax dollars are paying for all this. It can pay for a place to sleep. And then there's a fork in the road. For some, they love it, but the question is, what took so long? The only thing that the cops should be worried about is going around picking up garbage. For others, it's, what do these protesters really want? All the homeless people are gone. They left. They left when we were asked to leave, like we do every night when they ask us to leave. They, they made it more about their pushing their agenda. Get back, get back, get back, get back, get back. We tell you to leave, you leave. Joe Peterson says he thinks the people who showed up Saturday night have good intentions, but maybe let things get out of hand. He thinks they should avoid going to jail and focus more on the health department for throwing away people's warm blankets. Not the police for enforcing the law. We're trying to make a difference for people out there. Offering outreach, and actually, um, we've got... We've got day down here. Sorry. Reporting in Salt Lake City, Adam Herbetz, Fox 13 News.